everybody welcome to Nadia Collectibles my name is Nadia thank you so much for being here so today's video is going to be a very exciting video it is my first resin statue unboxing on my YouTube channel I normally post my resin statue unboxings on my TikTok but now I'll be able to go more in depth and show you the whole process of unboxing a resin talk you through everything and express my opinions on the resin I'm so excited not only is this my first resin statue unboxing on my YouTube I'm unboxing my first ever life-size one-to-one scale resin. I'm so excited. So today we'll be unboxing Joy Studios one-to-one -one scale attack titan bust. Also to note this is not actually titan sized. I would be in so much trouble if it was. Um, it's more so scale to human so it'll probably be around the same size as me. We'll see. I haven't opened it yet. I bought this resin from Fanatic Anime Store during their Black Friday sale. They had like 30 pages of different resins to choose from from their sale and all of the listings had free shipping for the resins and resin statue shipping can be pretty pricey so seeing all these amazing resins with free shipping was so crazy. Initially when I saw the list of the resins that they had for Black Friday I wasn't super interested at least in the first five pages just because the resins that I saw were from anime I haven't seen before and Fanatic Anime Store sent out coupon codes to their loyal customers so pretty much anybody that bought over 10 resins with their store for the year of 2020 and I know I bought a lot of resins in 2022 so I got an email from them for my coupon and I was thinking to myself I was like I'm sure this is like a $20 off coupon. I'm not super interested in the resins I'd seen in the first five pages. So I kind of just ignored the email for a little bit. And then literally on the last day that the coupon was supposed to expire, I went through all of the pages and I saw the life-size Attack Titan bust. So I tried putting in the coupon code just to see like what would happen or how much it really was. And it ended up being a $200 off coupon. I was so shook. I found out later that the reason why the coupon was so much was because I had purchased over 35 resins on their store for the year 2022 so it was pretty crazy regardless i got this resin for a crazy price i think i paid like 270 for a life-size bust with shipping included because it was free this was like a once in a lifetime opportunity for me because never did i think i would ever end up getting a life-size resin and not only a life-size resin but one of my favorite characters like Oh my goodness, I literally bought this sweater from the Crunchyroll sale just for this video. This resin is actually still in stock on Fanatic Anime Store, and if you'd be interested in getting it yourself, I do have a $15 off coupon with them. So this month, it's Nadia M. March. Hopefully it'll be of some use to you, and hopefully it'll save you some money. The resin still has free shipping on their website, so it is quite a steal, to say the least. So yeah, I'm just so grateful to Fanatic Anime Store for being able to give me this opportunity to buy this resin at such a great price. I never thought I would be able to get a life-size resin like I said before and to get it for this price feels unreal. So yeah I'm super excited to unbox this with you guys so let's go straight into the unboxing. Okay now change of scenery I'm here on the floor to show you guys how big this box is. This is me next to it it's literally bigger than my torso it's absolutely massive and here we see the big Joy Studio logo which is nice because now I know which one it is and what I love about Fanatic Anime Store is when they ship their resins they normally include these corner protector pieces a big risk with buying resin statues is the resin breaking during transit. But that's one of the main reasons why I love Fanatic Anime Store so much is they try their best to prevent any of that stuff from happening. So this has always worked really well for me. I hope it didn't break inside the box. I have no idea. We'll see. But yeah, this thing's absolutely huge. I almost died coming up the stairs bringing this upstairs by myself. Okay, to unbox this, I don't have my scalpel with me. So we're going to be using tweezers to try and get all this tape off. We'll see. This thing is so big. I'm so scared. The first thing I'm going to do is take off these corner pieces. Ouch! This is really hard with tweezers. <laughs> I don't know why. I need to go get like a knife or something. There's another corner piece underneath. This one doesn't have a corner piece. I guess it fell off or something. <laughs> I'm dying. So cool thing I noticed looking at the shipment box. We have Joy Studio. Sorry. We have Joy Station Collectibles AOT Aaron Bust. Piece made in China. Oh, I guess I got number 35 out of 200. That's super cool. I did not know there's only 200 made. That makes that pretty exclusive. That's awesome. Cool. That's nice. Ooh, that's awesome. I guess this has like the measurements and stuff for the resin. So that's nice to include on the outside of the box. Now let's try and get this art box out. I'm kind of scared. It's probably going to kill me. Oh my God. This is probably my least favorite part about unboxing is trying to get the art box out of the shipment box because it feels like there's literally glue on the shipment box. It's so hard to get them out. It's also hard to do this with just tweezers. I probably should have gotten a scalpel. Oh my God, this is so 
cool. I'm literally so shook. Guys, look at this. How the awesome is this? You see, it's upside down, sorry. We have all the different Titans that Joy Studio decided to do, Joy Station, my bad, um, with this line. So we have now the Attack Titan, we have the Armor Titan, the Colossal Titan, the Female Titan, and the Butt Beast Titan. I'm so excited, I really want them all now. I have no idea how I'm gonna get this art box out. I'm actually kind of scared. My knee is like breaking right now with this resting on top of it. I'm gonna try and stand and shake this out. So one sec, I'll be back. I'm not looking at the art box now. I'm not looking at the art box. I'm not looking, I'm not looking. I just wanna see what it looks like. Oh my God. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Look how cool this is. I'm literally so shook. That's so awesome. Oh my God. So I know that this resin also has LEDs for, the, for uh, Aaron's Attack Titan's eyes. I'm so out of breath, I'm dying. <laughs> This is so cool. Look how beautiful he looks. So we have Aaron Yeager, one to one scale. Uh, I don't know what centimeters to inches, so we'll pretend I know what that means. So this is designed by Joy Station, as we said earlier. And there's nothing on that side. I guess you can follow them on Facebook and their actual website here. That's nice. That's super cool. Nice promotion. And then you have like all the Joy Station symbols right there. Let's see what's on this side. Yeah, as I was explaining earlier, we see all the Titans that they have for this line. So again, the Attack Titan, the Female Titan, Colossal, Beast or Beast Titan, and the Armored Titan. I'm so out of breath, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's see what's on this side. Nice, another image of the line that they have. Ooh, okay, wait. <laughs> I'm dying. Oh my god. Okay, I'm probably gonna break my room. Okay, so now we have the actual image from the art box, which is just Aaron in his normal without the LEDs. <sighs> I'm so excited to get this open. I have no idea what the foam is going to look like inside. Um, I feel like this is minimal assembly since it's just the bus statue, but we'll have to see if this art box is insanity. I love it. I want to display this as its own thing. So yeah, if you like to add them on Facebook and here, I don't know if you can scan, but I will. I'm going to go check out their website now. But this is awesome, this is sick. It has some damage here and some creasing up here. So we'll see how the condition of the resin inside is like, but I'm so excited, I'm so, so excited. Okay, so now I'm gonna have to break my knee again to try and get it out from this side. We'll see how that goes. I actually don't know which side's right side up. I'm kind of scared a little bit. Okay, so normal foam packaging insert. Let's see which way it's supposed to go, I have no idea. Gauging by this, I'm gonna think this is where like the bulk of it is, so I have it upside down, I think. How am I gonna get this out? Actually, when I said before that taking the art box out of the shipment part is my least favorite, this is definitely my least favorite, and I think I just broke the art box, I'm so sad now. This is a terrible unboxing, I'm sorry, <laughs> I am struggling. Okay, I moved the camera because I have no idea how I'm about to get this thing out. So let's try this way, which is normally the way I do it, but this is big, so we'll see. I can't do this. I'm dying. Now oh, we got the foam out. I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm literally dying. Okay, so now we have the foam packaging out of the art box. And it has these nice straps, which I love when they do that because it just makes you feel like <clears throat> more secure on top, along with the tape, tape as well. So what is my assumption here? Okay, my assumption is that this is where the bulk will be and then this is where the front part is. So I'm gonna lay it down this way. This is a whole workout, I swear. So now I'm gonna take these off. Oops. Straps are off on the side, and straps are off on this side now. All right, now back with my tweezers. I'm gonna take off all the tape on one side because I don't like to do both sides since I can just put the foam back on as it was intended to be. I don't ever plan on reselling this, so I don't really mind if I damage. 
I get it? Kind of. I'm scared. I want to see what this looks like so bad. I'm still so shook how beautiful that art box was. I need to display that also. Oh, I feel something in my hand. <gasps> I can't. This is so crazy. Oh my god. I'm literally blushing. <laughs> I can't. <sighs> this thing is so massive. I'm kind of scared. I'm not joking. Guys, I'm scared. I don't want to take this out. Oh my god, ew, his teeth. It looks like real human teeth. I'm scared. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna rip this. Oh no, there's a lot of broken pieces. Oh no. Well, hair pieces. No, I'm kind of sad. Ew, this is so scary. <laughs> I'm literally grossed out. The teeth are so real. Oh, there's a lot of broken hair pieces. Mm, yeah, I'm sad. Ooh, what this? Sick. That's so cool. Oh my god, how gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Joy Station, you undid yourself. <laughs> oh my god. I can't get it out. Okay, so this is the coin. Usually shows you what piece you got. So I got number, you know, there's like fingerprints on it. I'm sorry. 35 out of 200. That's gorgeous. Look, and then you have the Attack Titan right there. I'm shaking because I'm so dead from unboxing this. Let me put that back in this beautiful box. Wow, that's a beautiful touch. Um, okay, so there is some assembly. It looks like... Oh my god! Uh, oh my god! Oh, that's so cute. Look, it's Aaron coming out of his Titan. That's so gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm beauty guru. Look. <laughs> oh my god, this is so beautiful. I'm about to cry. This is gorgeous. I'm putting him here for safety for now. Um, and then we have the effect pieces, like the steam coming off the Titan. I guess that's part of the assembly. Let me take those all out because I need to get this guy out and fix his hair before I show you guys because there's some damages, some broken pieces. Kind of sad about that. But that's okay because. Super glue is my best friend. So here's another piece. I guess those are the only two. Oh, I lied. Here's another. Another one. So it looks like three different pieces to assemble. Oh, I lied. Another one. <laughs> okay. What's this? Oh my God. This is so amazing. Oh, look. Okay, so I guess this, since there's like a backing piece, I guess that goes on the resin as well. Let me put that back where it came from. So we have another effect piece. What are these? Okay, so now we have a remote for the LEDs. This is gorgeous. I love that. Wow. Oh, and then Attack on Titan. Beautiful. This is stunning. Oh my gosh, they yeah, did themselves. Oh, there's more! <laughs> well, okay, so this is just the to plug in for the LEDs. Nice. I'm scared I'm missing something or something because I've missed like every single thing. Okay, I got everything. So now let's try and get this guy out of the box. Oh my god, I would never actually want to be an Attack on Titan. If I saw this thing face to face, I would throw up. Look, it's my little baby. It's my little baby. I just broke my finger there. Yeah, 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 baby. <laughs> the disrespect could probably kill me. No, please don't drop. Please don't drop. Please don't drop. Just be like, oh no, I just broke a piece. Oh, rip. I hate my life. He's scary. I don't like looking at his face. <laughs> it's scary. Okay, so I just broke my- I just broke a piece myself on accident. Guys, that was a lot. I'm dying. I can't believe I have this in front of me. I'm literally so shook and a little bit scared. This is fantastic. This is absolutely crazy. But let me just go straight into fixing this. Okay, I'm back. I've repaired as much as I can, so I had to super glue this part. 
this part and there's a missing strand right here somewhere that's broken that I can't find the piece for so for now we'll just pretend like it doesn't exist but yeah so now we can get straight into the assembly and I can show you details of this big boy now in person so I'm so excited this looks so cool I'm literally so scared of him but he looks amazing he's actually not that heavy and you need to see all the details on him because it's insane Okay, so my final thoughts on this piece is that it is absolutely fantastic. I think it's 100% worth the price. I got it for a steal, so I think anybody should go buy this resin. It is absolutely insane. It is such a crazy experience unboxing it, seeing something so big in one box. Like, it's absolutely wild. The details on his face are fantastic. The assembly was nice and easy. The only gripe I have is that the magnets at the bottom didn't fit too well. Um, otherwise, and obviously the breakage on the hair, but that's kind of probably my fault for bringing it up the stairs by myself. I, maybe I broke it, I don't know. But yeah, this is just such a stunning piece. The LED effects on his eyes add so much to it. It's literally so scary. I would never want to be on Attack on Titan. I would rather actually die. So yeah, I love this piece so, so much. I'm so excited to display this. I don't know where I'm going to put him yet, but I've been dying to open this one. Now after the Attack on Titan special that just aired last weekend, I'm so excited about this. I'm literally so hype. I love him so, so much. I love Aaron. I love the Attack Titan and the designs. I really want the rest of the Joy Station one-to-one -one scales now, eventually. I don't want to see the Colossal Titan in my room, though. He's scary. <laughs> So yeah, I'm super in love with this piece. I love it so, so much. And it's just a gorgeous display of the Attack Titan, perfect for anybody's collection. And I'm just so excited and so grateful to have this in my collection. So I'm so grateful to Fanatic Anime Store for allowing me to get this for a steal. I never in my life thought I would get a life-size resin. And now sitting next to one, it's just unreal. It's an unreal feeling. So I'm super grateful and I'm so excited about this one. Mr. Aaron Yeager right there in the bottom and then this beautiful Attack Titan. I'm so obsessed. I'm literally so obsessed. I can't believe it. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed my video today. If you liked the video, go ahead and give it a like. Subscribe if you'd like to. We're going to be unboxing a lot more things over the next coming weeks. Please let me know if you have any questions whatsoever about resin statues down below. I'm making a video on resin statue advice, so I'd love to answer questions or have some questions to include in my next video. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I still can't believe I own a like life-size resin now. I, I can't believe it. I appreciate your guys' support so much, so thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!